I don't wanna, but I'll do it. I know, I hear your mouth, I hear your scary words and your scary sounds. Just hurry up and twist your head around because I don't wanna hear it, baby. All right, guys, we are in North Olmsted, Ohio. I actually lived in North Olmsted at one point. We're about to go into this spirit Halloween here, and this is only the second spirit I've seen with a sign such as this. Actually, this is the first I've seen in person, but somebody posted a picture online the other day, and we were kind of discussing why they have a sign like that. However, this is in an old KG Men's Store, if you can read that label scar. It is a pretty cool looking store on the front here. That's a strange way to have the sign up at the top there. It's actual letters instead of a banner. But let's go ahead in and see what we can find in North Olmsted, Ohio. Spirit Halloween. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Wowzer, this is an enormous store, guys. What the heck, man? Ohio is a big Halloween state, guys, so it doesn't really surprise me that they still have lots of animatronics and stuff in their stores at this time of the season. Hello, Lord Farquaad. Let's just keep on moving. Here is the bog zombie. Let's go say hello to him. Hello, boggy. And they do not have a Grimm setup. I'm hoping they have one on the floor for sale because I would love to buy one today. Let's see if there's anybody in here amongst the bubbles of death. And there is not. I hear the bubbles of death. I see the bubbles of death. But we have no Crouchy and we have no Bari. We do have the chains of death, however. And let's go look at this pile of animatronics really quick, just in case there's a Grim in there that I can buy before anybody else. We have two punchies, we have a stuffed dummy prop, we have a deadly creeper. In fact, we have two deadly creepers, a Reagan and a Nozzles, but no Grim. I am bummed. Oh, we do have a Mr. Punchy over here, though. <laughs> but that's not what I'm looking for. I want a Grim. Let's go talk to Mr. Punk Punchy. Mr. Punky, a.k.a. Half a Head. All right, Mr. Punky. Give us a talk here. Come closer. Okay, a little I bit. I have something to tell you. Okay, go ahead and tell it's me. so funny. I promise you'll die laughing. <laughs> hmm. Oh, what do I see here? Okay, crap. I was hoping that we had more animatronics. It's just a whole bunch of stuffed dummy props and sinister spirit dolls. And we do have a Monty over here. We don't have one set up, but we do have one for sale. I've debated it and thought about it, but I don't think I want to buy a Monty. Maybe I'll change my mind and I'll buy him later on. I'll have to get him from, like, eBay unless he's available on the Spirit website. But I don't know. For right now... I don't want the Monty. All right, let's take a little walk around this enormous store and see what else we can find, guys. We do have a good handful of the Tiny Terror Sidesteppers. We got Lydia, we got Frankenstein, we got Billy Butcherson, Pennywise, and Sam. Man, they got a lot of Chucky greeters over here. And they got a handful of Sam greeters as well as some animatronic Chuckies and Tiffany's there. They got a bunch of guys set up back here, but first let's just walk back here and see if they would happen to have any other animatronics sitting around on the floor for sale, and I do not see any. Let's take a quick walk through the electrifying tunnel of death. Why do they always stop electrifying as soon as I walk in? I guess they're tired of trying to kill me. All right, let's take a look at this guy and what the heck is going on down here. Oh. Mr. Fix-It to the rescue! All right, guys, the staff is on fleek at this store, and they got that back up, and this guy going with a giant jalapeno nose. You gotta love nozzles. What the heck was that little shake? Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, his arm, like, hooked over here, and when he tried to turn, he had a little shake about him. I wasn't sure what he was doing. All right, let's check out Betty Sharp here. I'm not sure if she's even, there's no, wait a minute. Okay, there's a foot bat here. Let's see. Is this for Betty? Yes, it is. Mommy's favorite, but I took care of that. 
I know you did. Oh, we have the spooky boxes and we have the sitting scarecrow. I don't know if he's hooked up. Let's see if this foot pad, yep. He is so awesome. I love him so much. And I recently there was a video put up by Wicked Makers. I might have told you guys about this already. They totally redid the sitting scarecrow, made him look 100% better. He is so awesome. You guys got to go check it out. We got the jumping spider over here. Let's see if we can get him jumping. Here we go. This may be one of the last jumping spiders we see jump and try to kill us this whole season, guys. We only have two more stores to do after this. Oh, boy. Look who's staring at us over here, beckoning us, begging us to come over here and throw the switch. All right. I don't want to, but I'll do it. I know. I hear your mouth. I hear your scary words and your scary sounds. Just hurry up and twist your head around because I don't want to hear it, baby. I don't want to hear it. It's evil. Okay. I've heard enough from you, miss. You're grounded. I love when they have these kinds of displays out here and they have all the hanging ghosts and ghoulies, including these guys over here who all need the aqua fresh. Man, the hookhead hogs and hook eye guys must have been pretty popular this year because I haven't seen any in about the last 10 stores I've been in. We do have a plethora of zombie babies, and just like in most of the other stores, these are the ones we are seeing most often, guys. And we also have a plethora of the creepy baby dolls. We got a couple of hugs down here, the creepy cracked head doll, we got a couple of Rosalies, and a couple of decrepit Donnas. All right, let's take a look at some of the inflatables. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. I was looking to see if there was any secret keeping cats or creeping cats, and there are not. There's a whole bunch of bones over here, though. <laughs> oh, my God, that cracked me up. We do have some coffins. We have the scarecrow archways, the fright in the box. Oh, my gosh, look how many bumpy, spooky pumpkin pathway markers we have. Holy crap, there's literally seven boxes of those things right there. And look what they have right here, guys. The eight-foot inflatable skeleton that I was talking about getting the other day. Hmm. They also have the secret keeping cat inflatables and the haunted trees, as well as empty soul girl on a swing and the creepy crimson girl on a swing. Not much left in the ghost face department, though. Look, we have one dead by daylight red devil face. That's a kid's size costume. And we have one metallic purple ghost face mask. That's it as far as the masks go. All right, let's come on back up here, guys, and see if there are any animatronics that we have missed, and it does not look like it. It looks like I am more than likely going to have to order Grimm online to be delivered to the house. That's kind of a bummer. I wanted to pick him up and take him home in the back of the Hummer, but that is not going to happen. Oh, we do have a plush Crouchy here, and a plush Adam, and another plush Adam, and a plush Sam. We have the Bouncy Head Zero and the Bouncy Head Jack. Let's leave some stickers over here for Nazi, And let's leave some here for Jack Skellington. Let's come over here and leave some for Mr. Jumping Spider, because he did such a good job. And I thought I saw a cauldron somewhere around here. Uh-oh, people are just knocking stuff down. Ah, uh, yes, I do see a cauldron right there. Let's see real quick if they have that raven blanket, because that was a really, really soft, comfy blanket, and I do not see it, unfortunately. All right, I got, they are wooing up here. Somebody's donating money. <laughs> I guess that's it for this store, guys. Enormous store. I was really hoping they would have a Grimm in stock. I'm kind of not surprised that they don't, because it's right down to the end of the season here. But anyway, I can just always order it online. Oh, this is the best we're going to get. Hello, rat. And there is my donation. The ink is still wet. And look at this, guys. Up above, all the lyrics to spooky, scary skeletons on the stars. And we're going to leave some in Uncle Charlie's bucket. There you go. Yes.